Matt, thank you. And we're going in depth with the Target 12 investigators crime tracker. The latest homicide in Providence is the ninth of the year in Rhode Island, with most of them happening in the capital city. Target 12 has been tracking the crimes affecting your community, and Tim White is here now with a look at the number of homicides statewide. This interactive map from WPRI.com shows the location and other details from every homicide in the state in 2023. A black dot means there has been an arrest and a homicide, while a red dot means no arrest yet. Let's push into Providence. Five of the state's nine homicides have happened there, and two of them there has been no arrest. As we've been reporting, police just announced an arrest from Sunday night's homicide on Manton Avenue. The only other homicide without an arrest outside of Providence happened in Coventry. Police say James Beckman shot and killed his wife Linda Beckman, then turned the gun on himself. There is no charge listed there because it was a murder-suicide. In all, seven men and two women have been killed. Firearms were used in at least six of the nine killings. The first homicide was on January 30th in Providence. As developments happen in any of these cases, we will update this map, which you can find on WPRI.com. With the Target 12 investigators, Tim White, 12 News.